Well, I'm glad you asked, Brian. Let me give you a quick run through. Using the MailChimp platform, I simply replicate the previous newsletter, change the name, and save that. Then I go into the newsletter and start editing. The first thing to do is to go back to my website, go through the news section, and figure out which news items are new since the last newsletter. At this stage I'm also getting clear in my head which are the best news stories. In this case I've chosen the Teddy Sheehan story to go top of the bill. So I copy the headline, paste it into the newsletter, and in this case it's too long so I've got to edit it to pull it back to one line. Back to the website, copy the first paragraph, paste that into the story in the newsletter, get rid of that video reference because there's no video in the story, copy the hyperlink, add the hyperlink to the story, and change the hyperlink on the image. Then I go get the photo, bring it into Photoshop, resize it, and replace last week's photo with this week's photo. And that's one entry complete. Then it's just a matter of going through all the recent news stories, picking out the headlines and the first paragraphs, adding in the hyperlinks, editing for space, resizing photos, and uploading those photos to the relevant story. And I'll go through and do that for all the recent news stories. Now in this instance what I'm doing is making an advertisement. I recently formed an affiliate link with Retropilot. So now I do the advertising in my newsletter and when you use this link in this advertisement I get a commission. So now with all this week's news items placed in the newsletter I do a quick check then send myself a test email. And when that arrives then I open the email and click on every hyperlink to make sure they're all working as they should. Of course I should point out that a lot of this footage is fast forwarded. There's no way I'm this fast on the buttons. There's some really interesting stories in this newsletter too of course, like DVA being ordered by the government to turn around on their decision not to have a dawn service at Villiers Brand New this year. Happy birthday to Army, they got a new banner for their birthday present. Then with all the hyperlinks checked, one last thing to do, press the magic button to send it out. And yes, it really is that scary sending emails to 10,000 people. And when I do, yes, I always give the monkey a high five. 